Hello and welcome back to the Freelance Verse. I hope this channel is still going and it is still the Freelance Verse when you guys are watching this because um, I actually filmed this on the 3rd of January 2022, so the first working day of the year. And I've seen this trend on YouTube, a couple of my favorite YouTubers did this and I found it really interesting, so I wanted to make this video as well. I'm going to record this on the first day of working this year and schedule it on YouTube to upload by the end of the year. So basically the last upload of the year is what you will see right now. Uh, I try to do this as uncut as possible to keep it more authentic. I just want to just tell you guys what my plans are for the for the year, what I hope to expect, what I expect to achieve in terms of subscribers, views, uh, collaborations, etc. And my personal goals as well. And um, yeah, and then by the end of the year you see this and you can actually see if if it was all a dream or if it actually became reality. I, th I find this quite interesting. Um, at the moment of recording, I just hit 8,000 subscribers by the end of 2021, which is already a long time ago for you guys. Uh, for me, it just happened and this was my goal by the end of the year to reach 8,000 subscribers, which is incredible for me, a huge milestone. So I was thinking what the next milestone should be. Should be. So by the time you guys are watching this, I was thinking I would like to be at 25,000 subscribers or higher. So that's like my my goal. I want to be above 25,000. Now you can scroll down and see if it happened or not. I really hope it did. Of course, it only happens if I uh, keep up the, the consistent uploads like I did last year. Um, if not, then anyways, it's it's out of the out of the question. But that's also one of my goal. I want to keep. I want to match at least the uploads I did in 2021. Not exactly sure how many it is, but probably around like in the 30, 40s. I will do my yearly break in the summer again just to keep it fresh and then come back for season three. So you guys are watching now season three already. But yeah, if I manage to upload consistently, I should be over 25,000 by now, which would be crazy, which would be phenomenal. Because that is then like, a, like an actual decently sized channel and you can make some money with that. You can uh, grow something bigger with that. In terms of views, I expect to have some videos with more than 100,000 views. Uh, some will be uh, videos from this year or already from the past year. And I also expect some, some big views from the new videos that come up because I have some, some bigger plans. Because on YouTube, how it works, you always have to have these big videos that attract people, you know, that are very clickable. And then, of course, you also have to have the niche videos for you guys, for the community that I just want to inform, I just want to you know like how do you do invoicing how do you how do you use this cut tool etc these videos they don't make a lot of views uh, so you have these you have to make these kind of sensational videos to draw people in and i think i have a few of these planned especially at the beginning of 2022 looking back you can now check if my if my january videos did well they should do well i hope so <laughs> this is so weird because i don't know it's all in the future yeah, I mean, you guys are just about to enter 2023, so Happy New Year, I guess. It's so strange. Uh, I just started 2022 on like a personal or like a more uh, worldwide uh, uh, perspective. I really hope we got over COVID finally, but looking at the last two Decembers, um, my hopes are not that high, to be honest. I, I hope you guys are well. I hope we are not in the like the last few Greek letters of, of COVID variants. Um, I hope with some enough booster shots we should be over it by now, I really hope so, but everyone expected December 2021 to be over it and now we are as deep in it as ever. Uh, so yeah, I hope you guys are healthy, that's, that's what counts. Another big thing I wrote down that I hope to achieve in 2022 is uh, sponsorships and uh, collaborations like uh, with brands, because I think uh, I will hit 10,000 subscribers in like spring, maybe in March or something. And after 10,000, I know for a fact that uh, it's much easier to, to attract brands, you know, to if when I reach out to them with like 2000 subscribers, they're probably not that interested because there's nothing to convert there, right? But if I come with 10,000 with a couple of hundred thousand views videos, uh, there's something to, to talk about. So I would like to uh, do a few collaborations, uh, sponsorship is with brands in 2022. As always, I, I told you, I only will promote brands that I actually believe in and that are actually useful for freelancers, for translators, for uh, entrepreneurs in general. I know this is kind of uh, a difficult topic for some for some viewers, but if 
you know, if you're not into the brand, just skip it. I will put the bar, like a progress bar, how long the ad is, and you can just skip through it. That's no problem. Um, if it's not for you, it's not for you. But that's a goal. So I hope by now I will have achieved that. Uh, it will be interesting to see which is the which is the first brand. So I have a few in mind that I will reach out during the summer, and I'm curious uh, how they will react. I hope you guys are happy. That's the main concern of this channel, right? This was never intended to be like some kind of commercial channel or, or something financially viable. If it turns out to be one, great. I, I love it, right? Let's go over it. But the main goal is always to keep you guys happy, to keep you guys informed, uh, help the community, help people get into the industry, take kind of the stigma away, take the fear away before starting, right? Because it can be very... Uh, can be very daunting to get into this and I don't want this to be I don't I don't want there to be as many barriers as they were for me uh, so I try to break them down with every video a little bit more right to make it a little bit easier for you guys uh, as always I mean this year hopefully some of you wrote me for with video ideas but uh, also for 2023 please get in touch with me whatever you want to know like it can also be just a very simple question I then decide if I put it into a Q&A or if I make an actual video about it um, but that's also something that probably 2022 you will have noticed that my videos probably got a bit shorter uh, I want to have some videos in there that are just um, very easily digestible chunks of information because YouTube strike tries to, I guess it's the TikTok influence, but uh, there is a lot of change in, in YouTube happening at the moment and shorter content gets promoted much more. So there will probably be a few like four or five or even three minute videos in there this year. Yes, and uh, the last thing that I th I hope happened. Uh, if you watched my last video of this year, of well, 2021, um, you will have heard that I said that one big uh, overarching uh, term is, is expansion this year in 2022. Uh, I want to change something because I just don't have enough time to do everything. Uh, so I want to do uh, either employ someone or collaborate with someone that helps me out or have an intern or something like this. Uh, and I'm very curious what happens by the time you guys are watching this. Something will have happened in the expansion uh, territory. I will probably have told you in previous videos. Um, yeah, that's it. That's my goal. So over overall, like 25,000 subscribers, a couple of 100,000 views videos, some sponsorships on the channel, community very happy and engaging uh, or engaged and uh, consistent uploads and expansion. These are my goals. So try to figure out if it worked out. Let me know in the comments what you thought of this year, uh, if this channel was helpful to you, if it uh, met your expectation, exceeded or didn't exceed, didn't match. I'm very curious about your feedback. Have a good 2023. <laughs> a long way from, from now for me, but uh, I will be there at one point. And uh, I probably will forget about this video, so it will also be a surprise for me when I upload this. Let me just check when the last Monday is in in uh, this year. So that will be the 26th of December, so right after Christmas. I hope you had a great Christmas. Everything, everything went well for you. Uh, I'm probably on holiday at the moment. <laughs> I don't usually work at this time, so it's good that this video is scheduled by then and I don't have to think about it. And yeah, I see you next year, I guess. Uh, take care. Bye bye.